All right, YouTube, time for an update. Still battling with the uh, micro bubbles. Really, I haven't done anything to uh, get rid of them because I had a few other things that needed to be taken care of first. So, micro bubbles are still there. Um, the powder blue. He's just. I mean, he came down with the ick again, had to quarantine him again, left him for about a week and a half in the QT tank, and in the interim, decided that I'm going to go ahead and try and fight this a different way, because this joker is super, super sensitive to ick. So, what I've done is, I've included a... Uh, Scarlet Skunk Cleaner Shrimp. He's in here somewhere. That's his reflection. Let's see if I can get around the side. There he is. So I put a uh, Skunk Cleaner Shrimp in just yesterday. So he hasn't set up house and home yet. But hopefully he'll be able to help. And as well as the Skunk Cleaner Shrimp. I went ahead and purchased a uh, UV sterilizer. It's a Car Life Turbo Twist 6X. And got that sitting. Built a little stand for it. Got it pumping water with a uh, Rio pump. Little Rio 8 HF. Pumping the water in, then pumping the water right back into the sump instead of taking it straight to the tank. Um, don't know if that's going to make a difference, but that's what I'm doing. So far, the rest of the fish are doing really, really well. Um, that joker back there, the black percula ocellaris, I, I can never get him right, but that one, he's been bullying the small orange Percula Nemo. He's been he's just been bullying the hell out of me, and I don't know why. This just started not too long ago. Been bullying uh, that one. That's the small one. He's the smallest one in the tank, so I don't know. Might be picking on him just because of his size. There they go again. Whenever I come over to the tank, though, he he kind of calms down. But that's the latest update. Um, of course gonna have to have to have to since I promised that I would do a video on feeding the anemones so far the anemones are doing pretty good not bad not bad still there still flowing still looking healthy but that's the update for now I'm gonna start looking into buying some filter media to try to keep the uh, micro bubbles down and figure out a way once again you know to mount the lights in the canopy because I think I want to use the canopy this time anyway this is Testarossa 101 update on the 125 long signing out